stop. Geocaching is a modern day treasure hunt. You use GPS devices, your smartphone, uh, to position places on the planet where you hide hidden uh, treasures. So today we're going to be closing our distance learning with the video conferencing with our cooperating class in Richmond. Uh, during this session, it's a very quick session, what we want to do is to track the travels of our geobug as it's gone across Texas and perhaps answer questions from the students at the other end. And we created the idea of video conferencing and geocaching together and we call it geoconferencing which is exactly what we've done with El Paso today uh, and throughout the year. We hide the travel bug, we watch it uh, basically travel around Texas, cross our fingers, and um, hopefully it gets to its location. The, the, video, the video really helps us learn what other states have. It tells you where the geo bug has traveled. We actually learn a lot of things about them and they also do to us. I would say for the, to keep video conferencing because I like and you get to communicate with other people from different states and cities and um, it's fun so I really want to do it next year too. Um, I like about video conferencing is that I get that I get to communicate with other people that I never met from different states. Um, I think it is a good idea for classes so they could experience what it is to talk to someone from far away. It's very exciting because I will never get to go over there, so this is one of the, the best things that could happen to a classroom.